Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls for uh, Alpha 20 series. It is the morning of day 22 and I am pushing north. Um, I did go south. Uh, I'll just pop off the bike here in a second. I'm gonna grab some of these trees here. Yeah, I think we're good. So I did, I did head south. Kill you. Real quick. Ooh, goodbye. Okay, I headed south, and on the map, um, the wasteland goes all the way down and around and off to the side of the map here. So, rather than, you know, I, I mean, since I couldn't go through the wasteland, I went back to um, Eve's place, and I made a few bandages there last night. Um, what else did I do? That was pretty much it. Just hung out there for a little bit. Um... You know, getting my healing going. Now, I don't have any way to cure my infection. But I am deciding to push north here today. Um, there's a thing up there. I if we have a look on the map real quick here. Um, I got a marker up here. Because uh, I want to go up and see how much is up there. There's like a whole corner of the map that we haven't explored yet. I'm going to grab some more coconuts and some bananas. Just so that we can make some trees. So we don't have to come back out here for those. Grab that. Grab that. And let's keep pushing north. Hoping, like I said, to find a town or something up here with a trader. Now, I don't know if this is going to be... It most likely is. Desert all the way to the top of the map. Uh, but on the right-hand side, there's mountains all the way along. So my guess is that this is probably desert all the way up here. Um... But we'll push north for a bit. Hopefully, actually, I should probably go over to that place right there. And try and see if it's got some cars. Because we're going to run out of fuel if we're not careful. I've pretty much put everything into the bike now. So we're on our last little bit. Okay, we arrived at the compound. There's a few zombies here. Looks like there's a car in there. I'll probably go in and take that Son apart. Take care of that guy for me. Don't know what to expect in here. Kind of like fully expecting a dog. Like guard dogs. But... We don't get any. Cool with that. We'll grab what fuel we can. And beat a hasty retreat. 660, that ain't bad. Alright, let's get moving. Okay, we're heading straight north, and it doesn't look like there's anything up here. I think that mountain range up there is the edge of the map. So I think this is just all dead area. So we're going to go and head to the east. And see if we can actually find another town. I'm going to grab whatever I can grab out of this place here for fuel before we move on. Right, now, if I remember correctly, this place has got like a motor pool down here. Yeah, there's a military truck. Let's try and get these guys if we can. The birds. Come on, are you bringing it in or what? Nice. I think it's just the one. Alright, handle you. Okay. Oh, another zombie. Take care of you. Come on, you dirtbag. Get up here. I think he's a runner. Yeah. No sweat. Is it just the one guy? I guess so. Ooh, repair kit. Nothing else in here? Alright, we'll grab this stuff. Ooh. AR-15, some iron, or what do you want to call it? Uh, steel armor. I'm going to repair you. Are you coming in here? What are you doing? No fuel tanks, huh? Right, I don't know how long it's going to take this apart. Actually, let's take this workbench apart for the iron. We should get a couple hundred iron off that. And then we'll just take this truck, as much of this truck apart as we can. Alright, there we go. Got the whole truck. Now we got, I don't know how much gas out of that. Well, we got 1,100 now. 1,200 gas. That should be more than enough to get home. Uh, barring us finding more, um, more towns. Grab that. 
And that. And whatever's in here. A little bit of lead, we can scrap you. And then throw whatever we can into the bike. 742, we've got a full tank now, again, nice. Drop those in. I should probably, seven, eight. Excellent, how are we doing for weight here? Ah, eh, not bad. We're doing all right. Okay, so I'm pretty sure those mountains off to the left there are going off the map, but I did find this track that kind of leads around here. Man, the world gen is so much better than it ever used to be, you know? Like, now it's kind of a nice, got a, like a, a nice balance between rough areas and smooth areas. But I don't feel like when you go cross country that you're, like, going to take forever to get someplace. But then again, there's not a lot in the world. Even though I put the max, like, maxed out as many um, rural POIs as I could, there's still, like, a lot of nothing out here, right? So, and I guess in a way you kind of have to have that for a bit, but... I don't know. I just kind of like it to be a lot more. All right, well, that's the end of the pathway that leads us here. There's a couple of POIs that are over there. Actually, I should probably stop here. Those birds stopped following me? I guess they did. All right, I'm going to grab as much oil shale as I can grab in a, like a few minutes here. Just so that it makes up for the gas that we used. Get a bit of stone at the same time, because we could definitely use stone. Oh, you bastard. So we got a couple of uh, survivors out here running around. I'm like, where who are they running after? They're they're chasing something. I'm like, I don't Did they detect a zombie? Nope. You know what they're doing? They're chasing that bird. They're just decided that they're going to chase that bird and hopefully catch it or something. I don't know. But you know what, guys? More power to you. If you think you can catch it, go for it. I'll be down here getting some oil shell. Oop, zombie came right up on us here. These guys are not doing their jobs. Alright, well, we almost got 2,000. It's not bad. That'll be like 20,000, I think, when we, once we uh, make it into fuel. So that should give us a couple of stacks of fuel, which I think is probably plenty. Um, how are we doing for stone? We got 4,000. Not bad. Anything else I need from the desert? I don't think so. I know there's lead out here, but... Yeah, I think we're done with the desert for now. So let's get going into here. Alright, moving into the green biome. We just got a bunch of rain. Which is kind of a good thing. It can clean us off here. We are covered. We are covered in dust. Hopefully, it doesn't uh, turn into concrete on us here. Um, yeah, I don't even know where to go here. Just gonna drive across this way straight towards our house. We do have a horde coming tonight. Horde base is ready, so I'm not that worried about it. If we don't encounter a um, a town or a city here, so be it. Uh, but we're going to just drive straight towards our house. Get back to town. If we get there a little earlier, uh, I might go see Hugh because he restocked yesterday. Um, you know what? Actually, let's go. If we can go to Jen's, I think, first. Uh, that might be a good idea just because I want to get this infection gone. And if she's got antibiotics, it'd be nice to be able to just buy them. I know we have some at home, but um, I want to keep those for a rainy day. Well, a rainier day, I guess. All right, well, I found a bit of a path. It was a little narrower back where we were. Well, a little bit behind us. It's widening out, so these usually lead to main roads. So I don't know, map-wise, where this one's actually going to go. It might come down here, or there might be a town down here, which would be really nice. All right, the weather's starting to clear up a little bit. Looks like this path takes us through the mountains here, which is nice. Uh, did we go this way before? Uh, looks like it's going to hook up back here. Alright, well, I think we're going to go... I don't know how these mountains go. We're going to go this way and go straight. Just to save a bit of time. We're going to head to that trader, Trader Bob. Um, we'll go straight to him first. Because I think he's just... 
here, right? Let's put the waypoint, 1.1 kilometers. So we'll go to him, sell what we can, um, and then head home. That way I don't have to hit up Hugh or anybody in our town once we get there. And then once we get to our town, ooh, this is going to be interesting. Um, once we get to our town, um, if we have the time, we might be able to uh, raid a building near our house or something. All right, well, I'm going to rule out the whole northwest part of this map as being nothing. Like, there might be something up here, but there's nothing that's obvious, so I'm just going to rule it out, probably. We'll focus on stuff. Now, we haven't found the, uh, the um, snow biome yet, so that's got to be somewhere. Probably directly south of us, or southeast, I guess. It could be on the other side of the wasteland, too. I don't know. All right, let's... Um, we can in there gas wise that's it for our gas see if Bob's got any antibiotics probably not hey what's up Bob do you want engines this time you didn't last time you don't this time either I'm gonna hang on to that we're gonna sell you all of this do you want batteries sure take the batteries eh I'll take that what about this stuff I could take the dyes out of those but it can't be bothered at this point Nope, don't want those, eh? Uh, shoes, sure. A couple weapons, AR, yeah, nice. Pink dye, sure. What about the calipers? Yeah, nice. Took most of the stuff off our hands. That's excellent. Now, um, medical supplies. You got sewing kits. That's about it, huh? What about in here? Anything worthwhile? Yeah, see, MD500. 245,000. That should, that should probably be the end goal for the game is we need to fly out of here on a helicopter or something. Uh, it would be nice to have that going into the uh, into uh, the radiation. We could just fly to where we need to go, land, and then <laughs> take on whatever's there. Uh, motorcycle stuff, no. Um, mods, nothing really important. Ammo, do you have shotgun ammo? Then I could feel a bit more comfortable about... Uh, just firing it off tonight for the horde. No. So we'll hold off. You don't have any gunpowder. Nothing there. Nothing really here either. Dude, are, you're not making me feel confident about wanting to come back to you at all. But I think we hit you up on day 21, so you probably don't have anything else. Thank you, Survivor. Yeah. Check back soon. I, get new I could go in and search this place more, but we need to get out of here. Let's get back home. Alright, looks like we're rolling into Jen's town here. Now, I do want to go to her place. Uh, she's right here. But let's see if we can open up a bit more of this town. We'll go in. I mean, I don't know. We might find another uh, cracker book or something in here, which would make it worth our while to come back over here. Um, it's going to be a bit laggy, and I'm okay with that, but... Getting this place opened up is going to be uh, good for us, I think. Actually, before we go too much farther, I mean, we got enough gas, but I just want to make sure. Just grab this real quick while we got the ability to gas you up. Ah, 73% is plenty. All right, now, have we already been through this part of town? I don't think that we have. We have not. All right. We found another cracker book, which is nice. That's actually relatively easy to clear. What else do we have? Another cracker book. Have we been to this one? Right here. All right, another one. That's the plating place with the gun bag, but we want to get to Jen. So, um, man, there's a quest here for her too. Is this a fetch? What is this one? Let's find out. If it's a fetch, we can just wing it off real quick. Pick up a bit of coin when we get to her place. But if it's a clear or something along that line, then... It's a clear. All right, we'll leave it. A little bit more, a little bit more time than I'm willing to expend at this moment. All right, let's kill a couple of the uh, locals here before we go see Jen. 
Get some stuff sorted. Big Mama's coming down. Let's go handle her. Ooh, nice. Pooping out a bag. Some dog food. Which is not really a joke, but... Let's see what you got here. So, what are you buying today? Uh, I'm not really buying anything, Jen. Well, maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. But I got some engines for you. Bob said you might be able to use those. Sell you the battery. Sell you those two things. Uh, anything else that we want to sell you? I can't buy... You can't sell any more of those. Um, that's it. So let's see what you've got here. Ooh, we've got some military gear starting to show up, which is nice. We're going to buy your shotgun rounds. What are we at? 1900? It's not too bad. If you have a solar bank, that would be worth it. There we go. Thanks for the business. Stay safe out there. Go ahead and use that right now. Problem solved. All right. Um, inventory. Uh, no, we want to go here first. Um, Super corn seed. Doesn't do me any good at the moment. Rocket launcher schematic we've already got. Wow, mortar and pestle. 2450 and it's like 40 clay. Really? But I guess if you can't make it, it's probably... Uh, I don't know if it's worth it. Still, I don't think it's worth it. One grain alcohol. Not a lot. Military vest. I should really start buying the military gear. Because that's our next step up from what we have. Um, let's buy that. We've already been through that. Nothing that we want here either. Now, there was... Yeah, military gloves in here. Level 2 is not... Well, it's not going to cut it because we have three things in our gloves right now. Although, I guess I could port one of them over to something else. Like the chest or something to balance it out. But now nah, we're not really ready for it yet. I don't know why I bought this one. We're not really ready for it yet because I want to get the uh, advanced connectors and I want to get security done so that we can get. Um, Alrighty then. Yeah. Stay safe out there. We want to get security done so that we can get the maneuver and armor skill. Because um, when you max that out. So. Military armor for each piece gives you minus 5% mobility, right? So with five pieces on, you're minus 25% mobility. You're moving at 75% of your normal speed. That's before encumbrance. Then um, it also adds a little bit more to your stamina. So if you add the advanced fittings, which reduce the um, mobility by 2% per piece, right? You can get five of those in, meaning rather than um, suffering a minus 25% penalty, you're only suffering a minus 15% penalty. So you're moving at 85% of your normal speed. And then with that, that I believe it's security that has the, um, like the, the skill that allows you to maneuver better in armor. Um, and that, when it's maxed out, will give you an additional 3% per piece of armor, right? Which is then it ends up, at, with five pieces, ends up being another 15% of your mobility back which then gives you a, a mobility of 100% uh, again. Uh, before, of course, before encumbrance and before any other modifiers. Whoops, excuse me. Um, so that's a good thing to, to do. Now, I like to do that all at once. I don't like to just put on like armor and stuff and then um, still be like, in, like have a reduced uh, movement rate and all that kind of stuff. I would rather, Put it on and be ready to go. So we're gonna wait until we can do that and at least have full mobility, you know? All right, we're gonna take care of the locals here first. Do I really care at the moment? No, let's not do that. Um, yeah, because I want to harvest the stuff out here too, I think. We don't really need to harvest the stuff out here though because we're sitting pretty good already. Let's grab you, though. Kill you. Alright. I should put a mortar and pestle out here, too, so when we get feed, we can, uh... Let's make... As much as we can. Four. That's not bad. Place the Molotovs. 
And it's really these guys. I mean, we got tons of eggs right now, so I'm not really that worried about it. So we'll grab what we can. That's already been damaged. Wow, seven eggs. Even getting eggs out of that. Yeah, man, I got it before you even got here. Bring it. Okay, let's... Um, I'm not worried about that, but let's repair... You. Uh, apparently I can't. I don't know what I need to repair it with. You'd think it would just been wood or something, but apparently not. Alright, let's get everything upstairs. Put away, and then... I think we're like... Yeah, I mean, it's not that bad. We've still got a lot, a fair bit of time. So maybe we try to take out one of the buildings close by here. Uh, let's just grab all of that. Oh, you know what? Before I forget, because you know damn well I will, let's get these things put back. Ah, <laughs> uh, Because if I don't do it now, it'll be like the horde will come in and I'll be like, oh, yeah, where's my uh, junk sledges? Oh, yeah, they're still in the motorbiker. Oh, yeah, they're uh, up in one of the boxes. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you scared the shit right out of me. Oh, man, she was moving faster than I thought she was. All right. Um, God damn. I turn and she's like right there. <laughs> All right. Uh, heart attack. Uh, where are you here? Here we go. Actually, you know what? Let's repair you, because we got repair kits on us, right? Yeah, we do. Just repair that real quick. Anything else we can repair here? I'm not going to repair that because it'll lower in quality, I think. Um, yeah, I think that's it. We can scrap this, though. Actually, we'll leave it. Because I can disassemble it, so we'll do that. Alright. Now, let's go put the stuff away. Alright, so we got the concrete mix going. I'm going to merge these two... Uh, ratchets. Now, uh, people generally take stuff out of the ratchet or out of your tool when you're when you're merging. That really, you really only need to worry about that is if it's going to pass the level it's on now. If it's on a current level and it's, you're only adding a bit at the bottom, you won't lose anything off of it. It's only if you merge two items and it goes past the level it's supposed to be at. So, all right, let's get all of this moving. Actually, let's get a thousand of it moving. Um, so this one. I want to keep some, um, like that. Uh, I want to keep a little bit of it, um, just so I can, if I need to make oil a little bit later, I can do that. Uh, so let's keep some of that. Um, so yeah, we're good. Let's go take a look around here then. So everything is dropped off. I don't think we need to do too much more. What building do we want to hit up? I mean, we could go in there. COC chemicals. Go see what it's got. Let's bring the bike over in case there's like a lot of stuff in here. It's eerily quiet. Um, locked. Okay, let's do, um, I put my Molotovs away, so let's bring the grenades down just in case. Oh. Hey guys. Can I actually shoot them from here? Oh, I can. Wake them both up too. Let's not waste time. Oh, that guy broke out. Oh, more of them. One guy's a runner. Alright, not bad. Damn it! Damn it! There we go. Ooh, some motion sensors. 
Is that it for in here? I think so. Take the ammo. Take the ammo, leave the poop. Let's see if we can remember to uh, turn our turret on tonight, because uh, that would be handy. We got attacked by a couple of vultures last time. All because I forgot to turn the turret on. Uh, a couple of bags. These guys are nice. Nice to leave me some bags. Wire tools. Some switches. Okay. Hoping for something better, but... And this should all be murky water stuff. Yeah, chemicals. I don't know if they're going to be adding any other chemicals or stuff to the game. It'd be kind of interesting if they added more than just, like, what they got right now. But I'm sure they will. It's just a matter of time. Now, I think this is probably the way you're supposed to go in this POI. But, you know me. Grab that. Not going to pass up a little bit of free cobble. Now, there should be, yeah, that thing back here. Oops, I should have checked it first. But murky water's not like we can't get that. Grabbing all the free plastic we can get here, too. Plastic and paper, baby. Plastic and paper. It's what the game's all about. Okay, that clears this out pretty well. Let's actually clear out this. Alright, a little bit more electrical parts. At some point, we'll be ready for the... Uh, at the coil stuff. Oh, I see you guys. Apparently you saw me too. I saw the shadow. I saw the shadow. And I was like, what the fuck is that? It seemed a lot bigger than the one guy. Okay, any fuel? Nothing. Can't get in that way. Let's not get caught around back here. Let's get out in the open, out in front. Where we can, we've got room to maneuver. That's a nice, nice amount of murky water. Locked. Locked. That's all locked too. Oop, thank you. Now we check. Oh, hey. Oh, man, we got lucky there. Got lucky there. We have not checked this truck. Okay, not bad. Some repair kits and stuff. Those guys will just follow me home anyway. So still a little bit laggy facing downtown, but... Not anywhere near as bad as it used to be. All right, it's just that, like, once I'm away from downtown, it's not so bad. It's just the downtown that's pretty shitty. Okay, we got radiated in there. Ah, uh, let's not mess around too much. Let's grab what we can out here. Go through the trash, go through the car across the street. Um, just clean up a little bit of this stuff out here. Hopefully we find some half-decent stuff here. Alright, we got crickets. At some point I should probably just go in here and break up like all the transistors and stuff. Might be worth it for the electrical parts, I don't know. We'll see. Alright, we're going to park the bike. Um... 56% gas. That's not bad. We'll park the bike. Go upstairs. Grab the stuff we need for a horde. Relax a little bit, I think. Uh, I want to get some more steel moving, though. I, I know we picked up a fair amount of iron while we were out. All those workbenches. Like, the, all the these guys give you 200 iron when you wrench them, so it's actually not bad. We ended up with... Oh, well, we got, only got 2,900. Not as much as I was hoping we would have. Okay, drop those in there. All the stuff we want to sell at the traders can go in here. Which is not a lot. Already got a wire tool. Uh, we can scrap that. 
modify you, take out the die. I know it's only like worth one or two, but we'll sell it anyway. I'm gonna start keeping the cans. Let's open up these guys. You can keep it when you want to keep that. We might as well hang on to these for tonight. Um, actually, let's just merge. Take you out of there. I think the iron pickaxe is pretty much is done for us now. I think we're going to switch to steel. Now, question is, can I get it into there? No, I can't. Yeah, see, when it goes to 34, we lose the uh, stuff on there. So now we have to modify it before we do it. And then we can put it back on. Okay. Um, Gunpowder. You guys can go in there. Uh, motion sensors. Switches. You and you. And you. Okay, so the stuff we don't need for Horde can go into here. Uh, we, I don't know if we need the wood or not. We're not going to take the bow, so let's leave that here. Shovel we don't need. Axe we don't need. I worry about switching the tools tomorrow. Ratchet we definitely don't need. We don't need the crowbar. Let's keep these guys just in case. Shotgun is going to go here. Let's bring you down. Let's get some clay out. Uh, I want to try and get another 100 um, steel going if we can. Can we get 100? It's only 1,000. Uh, wait, how much steel do we have? 75. So we need another 175. Let's let's make 200 then. I don't know why I was waffling over that. Let's make 200. Use most of our iron, but that's fine. Then, then we can make another of the advanced forges as well. So that's done. Um, okay, so there's nothing there. We got two green cards. That's it. Hopefully we can pick up some more tonight. I mean, we couldn't go to that command bunker anyway. You need the cards to kind of get in there, I think. We've got four pieces of hazmat gear. So that's good. I think I'm going to... I want to upgrade the hatches tonight. I don't think so. I think we're still good. Uh, let's grab our stuff. So we're going to need some molotovs. Um, let's grab two stacks of shotgun ammo. A backup stack for molotovs. Uh, we want to definitely have this on us. Um, grabbing those. Let's grab a little bit of this. Uh, we can turn you back on. We'll have lots of gas for that now. Okay. Let's open you up. Unlock the ammo. Lock the ammo. So that's ready to go tonight. Because it's turned on. Like I said, eventually we're going to have a switch for downstairs. So we can just do it all from down below. And there's nothing in there we need. Nothing in there we need. Oh, yeah. You know what we forgot last time was repair material. Um, okay. As far as guns and ammo go, we're not going to be using this at all. So I'm not going to bother bringing it. I mean, we got... Uh, contact grenades are just a recipe for disaster, though. Like, if we go with contact grenades, like, I know I'll... It'll detonate against the wall, for crying out loud. I just know it'll happen. Alright, we're good there. Uh, anything else? Uh, we got enough ammo. What am I forgetting? I got, I got repair kits. I got four repair kits, so that's plenty. Oh, man, I know I'm forgetting something. Oh, um... Let's grab... You for repairs in the morning. We got the concrete on us. We'll keep a thousand on us. We've got iron on us. Um, regular cobblestone. Sure. Oh, uh, our first aid stuff. So we want to grab one of these guys for tonight. Let's grab one of these. One of these. And one of... We had two antibiotics. Nice. Oh, we got so many uh, herbal antibiotics. It's ridiculous. Let's keep one on us in case we get hit. You never know. Um, and then... Come on. One of these guys. That should probably be enough. Alright, let's get over there. I'm going to go this way. We'll walk up the ramp. Alright, should be a good horde tonight. 
This should be another easy one. Day 22. I think this is what? Our 10th? Is it 10th horde? It can't be the 10th horde, is it? Could be. 9th or 10th. Something like that. Put both of those up to start. Let's get into here. And let's grab our junk turret down. Let's make sure we're loaded. 106 rounds. So I guess the best thing we can do is here. That's still pretty good, though, for us. That's guarding our ass pretty well here. I mean, it did shred that one spider monkey that tried to get to us last time, so... Should be fine. Right? What could go wrong? What could go wrong? Other than, like, a demolisher showing up and blowing up the front of the building. What could really go wrong? Let's load you up. Alright, um, drink one of these guys before we start. Should have eaten something, but we're good to go. Um, uh, okay, cool. Having a quick look at our character, we got one point to spend. So automatic weapons we've raised up already. I don't know. Bladed defense is not bad. Incoming damage reduced reduction by 5% is not bad. Pistol weapons. Yeah, I don't think we're ever going to be using pistols in this like, again. Uh, rate of fires for rifles. We could go that route. Hmm. We're good there. Scavenger is good. What was the one we were looking at before, though? Laborer, right? Maxing out engineering. Like, we're still... The hordes aren't at the point where we're, like... I have to worry too, too much about them. I mean, you gotta worry about them, but not as much as we would normally. Uh, we could go armor, we could go science. Reducing crafting con by 4%. Like, I mean, we gotta spend these points anyway, but we can't get to here until level 80. So, I'm not that worried about it. Maybe we go into armor crafting. Um... Yeah, let me think about it. We got birds already, huh? Grab that. Turret's working. Alright. Bring it, you guys. Do we have anybody tough yet? No, we got average. Looks like they're making their way through the building just fine. I don't know where their initial spawn is. It's definitely not out there. We have no radiators either. Well. All right, that well, there's our first radiated. Get off the wall. Nice. First bag of the night. I think we'll rock with it with this for a while. Get the skill up a bit. The more hits, the better. Definitely gonna get some good hits down here. All right, we got a load of them. All right, I got a few, not a lot. Yeah, this is not really set up. We need a pit down here. At least that guy got, uh, got set on fire. Is that a cop? Nope. I think we get, if these junk turrets kill the zombie, I think we get the points for it. I'm pretty sure we do. Which makes it a little bit better than electricity, right? I don't know why we were bouncing there for a second. Ah, uh, you know what I meant to do? I meant to put the uh, rad remover in the turret before the horde start. We've got it in the spear right now. But with it in the turret, it's gonna like stop them from, from regening. Oh, fuck, they're hitting the walls again. That should, that should handle them.
mind. That was terrible. Get up. I couldn't ski shoot that guy. I was close to being able to do it, but not quite. Ah, damn it. I thought that was going to be a hit for sure. Would you die already? Okay, military guy. Stop hitting the wall. Can't run so fast when you're shot in the legs, can you? He's done. Ooh, we got that guy midair. Yes, Kenny, run right through the fire. No cops yet. Good stuff. We need to be game stage 150 before the demos show up. We should be getting that, approaching that pretty, pretty soon. Forgot to check what we are, what our status was before we started here, but yeah, we're 103, so we got a little bit of time before that actually happens. Ooh. Nice. I heard somebody gurgling. I think it, maybe it was one of those, uh, the pus boys, whatever they're called. Come on, stay in my field of fire. There we go. Pick up that biker. Yes. Finally getting the hang of these Molotovs at that location. All right, get up here. Don't know if we killed that military guy. I think he died. Wow, that was lame. I should really wait for them to drop down here. Those turrets fire really fast. He's done. Somebody's inside banging on some shit. Come on, you bastards. Don't hit the walls, Mo. I gave you a clear path. Take the walkway. Keep shooting. I got one shot on him, I think. Yeah, they're in. Some of them are inside. Okay, hopefully that bird goes up. I think that's the bird spitting. Nice one. Let's actually repair this. I think that's the bird spitting. We got some time. Do a bit of work with the shotgun. So much more effective. Ooh, okay. There's the first spider of the night. Oh, hey buddy. Nice. Yeah, that's. I think well, that was a cop over there, I think. Come on, fly up. I think we got the bird. Wow, they're really putting the pressure on us in here tonight. I mean, they're not really doing damage, but they're putting the pressure on us. Who is 
that spinning out there? Is that a bird? They seem pretty low. I guess the birds start lower to the ground. I'm pretty sure they do. Infection's almost gone, though. In, in, in other news... That's a lot of points. That's a lot of points. Alright, a bit of ammo back. Something to repair the shotgun with. Yeah, see, they're missing us completely now, which is great. Uh, let's get these um, radiated dogs here if we can. Yeah, he just kept running. Hi there. Okay, got the oh. flew right in there. Just flew right in there. Oh, he fell off. He'll be back. There you are. Thanks for showing up. Bringing me another bag. Appreciate it. Eh. Ah, uh, what? Suffer? Not today, I won't. Okay, couldn't get the radiated dog. Ooh, blue bag. Alright. Fuck off, these fucking birds, man. Turret, do your job. I gotta angle it, I think, a little more. Yeah, man, the shock on these things is so good. That dog's gonna blow up. Yeah. It's not a good time. Leg? Yep. Got him before he even got to me. Nice. We got some good bag drops tonight. Good bag drops tonight. I think I got him. You're down. We're taking a bit of damage now. I think it's from the birds, mostly. That dog's got some speed, man. Skeet, shoot him. I think he's dead. Come on. There we go. I think as long as I'm not like right at the front, should be fine. Ooh, that guy paid for it. All right, back to the AK for a bit. You're dead. Yeah, they can't make it past. Okay, landing a few shots. Oh, I should have shot there. Oh, well. Dog, man. Got him. Yeah, we need to get our... Oop, skeet shooting. We need to get our uh, concrete production up and running so we can get all this all into, all into concrete. First cop for the night. He's down.
He got in again. If we're not careful, that's going to be the death of us. That's going to be the death of us if we're not careful. So I'm going to have to, like, do something about this window. I don't know what yet. But something's going to need to be done. That didn't land where I wanted it to. This one might, though. Ah, for fuck's sakes, really? I think I burned those, uh, for the, uh, first aid kits. Got him. Lousy shooting, but we got him. Get back to the shotgun, I think. Finish this horde up with the shotgun. Yeah, they're, like, inside. I wonder if somebody is caught on the, uh, that one bar that was across down there. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Are you at the door? You are. I don't know how to stop that. Like, I mean, maybe we put up, like, bars across here, like, sticking outward? I mean, it stops our ability to shoot down, but... That was a cop. There he is. Can't see him here, though. Come on, buddy. There we go. Three shots. Damn it, missed. Another level, though. Yeah, they're right here. I mean, I bet you if the stairs were out, like, I don't know, like three or four more blocks. The spider zombies wouldn't try and jump from there. I bet you if we could do that, that would probably work a lot better. Maybe we do that for the next, the next, uh, like on that side of the base. Have it stick out a little more. Bring the junk turrets in a, a bit. You're not coming in that way. Birds have stopped at least. These fucking guys, though. Got them. All right, working this horde. We're not going to get away scot-free, I don't think, on any horde night. Like, damage-wise. We're probably... Oh, there's the morning. Probably always going to take damage. That sounded like a demo. It's totally a demo. That cop died. That's a demo. Uh, I'm going to put one of these on. I'm going to have to go buy some aloe, I think, from the trader. Alright, well... Yeah, that's a demo. And here I thought it was going to be 150 that they show up, but... Apparently not. So he's bleeding right now. What do we got down here? Bunch of runners. Got some bleeding going on you. Hey, lady. Uh, you don't mind if I, uh, take a rain check on you and me fighting, do you? Okay, that problem is solved. That problem is solved. Come on, you two. 
Let's take care of these two guys first if we can. Did that cop die? Or the uh, military guy I think might have died. Oh shit! Got him. Yeah. What'd you give me? Alright. Actually, we can just go ahead and repair those now. Repair that. We got somebody inside. I don't hear any monkeys trapped inside anymore. Okay, that was another AK. Level 5, though. Alright, well. We can use it to repair the one we have. Alright, lever action rifle. So that's better than the regular rifle we have. Alright, some leg armor we can actually repair and sell. That's the end of the horde there. Alright, so I think what we're going to do once we get all this stuff is I'm going to take stock of what we got for the horde night and then tomorrow we'll probably spend the time uh, repairing the horde base and then I'll worry about um, what we're going to do uh, for the rest of the day after that and then what we do tomorrow. Um, let's just quickly do this. Get that back into place. I think that's it for the blocks that they broke. So they broke a couple blocks. Not too much, but as you can see with this walkway, right? They can beat all they want down here on these blocks. You know, all it does is it just delays them from you know, getting up to the up the ramp or whatever, but they they can take it as many of these blocks out as they want, and they still and it's not going to affect the ramp in any way, right? Which is the good thing about this base. Now we just got to fix this window and those spiders getting in, and it's it's got to be that they're leaping from there over here, and uh, maybe if this was back further, you know, like starting here, so that by the time they get to the top, they're like somewhere here. Now they still got a clear shot. I don't know. I think maybe it's just because that's like at the extent of their reach. Anyway, that's a tomorrow thing. I am going to clean up down here and the episode here. Um, when we come back tomorrow, like I said, we'll work on the base, get it up and running, uh, make sure everything is fixed. I think we go to steel hatches. Uh, I want to try and put some bars in uh, to protect versus those jumpers up there. Hopefully they won't get in. I, I, there's no way to guarantee. I'm going to actually have a quick look in here before we finish the episode, just in case there's anything that's dropped in here. I doubt it, but yeah, nothing here. That's fine. Um, so yeah, what I'll do is I'll do that tomorrow. Um, what else? I think that's about it. There's nothing else that's really um, that's pressing. And then... Um, yeah, we'll go from there. I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you all later.